Here's your paper. I, Riku Sahara, fell in love at this moment. The long, wavy hair, her clear, light brown eyes, and her fine nose. There isn't a person in this school that doesn't know her. <laughs> Thanks! Oh no, my face is red. She picked up a pile of paper that I dropped on the floor right away. I could tell how beautiful she, Narumi Kamiya, was, because our faces were so close. No wonder everyone says that she is the most beautiful girl in the school. I couldn't take my eyes off of her. This should be everything. Um, I... I like you, Narumi. Those words naturally fell out of my mouth after seeing her face. I didn't understand why I was saying this. We aren't even in the same class, and it was my first time talking to her today. I'm an introvert with no friends, and she's the popular girl at school. We are completely different. Um, that's really sweet, but sorry. I guess that was a natural response. But I don't think anyone would accept a love confession from a person they have never talked to. And we're talking about Kamiya. There are tons of good-looking guys for her. Much better than introverts like me. I'll be going now. Be careful not to drop your stuff next time. The day I fell in love, I confessed my love to someone for the first time in my life. And got rejected for the first time in my life. Ah! I fell onto my sofa when I got home. I can't believe it! I didn't know that being rejected could hurt so badly! But if you think about it, there's no way I wouldn't have not got rejected. But still! Even if that's the case, my heart is aching so badly! Do the people with boyfriends and girlfriends out there know how painful this is? If they do, they are warriors! Oh! Onishan! You're home! The living room door opened. The girl that walked through was a cute-looking girl who was wearing her school uniform in a rough manner. I'm home. You look depressed more than usual, Oni-chan. She's my little sister, Mikan. The difference between us, of how she's super cute and how I'm the biggest loser introvert, is one of the biggest family mysteries. I got rejected today. And? And? Her cold attitude makes me want to cry. Your brother just got rejected! But you just slapped me in the face with one word? It's like my heart was shattered into pieces and then shredded into nothing! I've told you, you can stay by my side forever. Isn't that called being a freeloader? How could I be dependent on my younger sister? But it is rare that you, an introvert, would confess your love to any girl apart from me. I've never even done it before. And don't make it sound like I've done it to you! And? Who did you tell it to? Kamiya. I told Mikan what happened today. Wow, Oni-chan. You are one of a kind. I can't believe you confessed to someone you've never even spoken to. And to the famous beauty of the school Kamiya? Y you think so? My sister praised me for it. It was hurtful to get rejected. But the fact that I was brave enough to tell her that I love her must be something wonderful. Introverts can be really dumb sometimes, can't they? She was just making fun of me. Here's the thing. You need to differentiate between being brave, doing something impossible, and being an asshole. Hold on one second! I've never not been able to tell what an asshole is! I'm starting to think you don't like me. But she is currently lying on my lap, so what does that mean? But yeah, I guess it was something impossible like you say. I feel bad for Kamiya now. I think I'll give up on- What are you talking about? My chin! Mikan stood up suddenly, and her head hit my chin with extreme momentum. It's too early to give up. Can you worry about your brother before you tell me what to do? Listen to me. Only introverts give up after just telling someone how they feel. Well, I am an introvert, unlike you. One rejection isn't the end of the world. You still have plenty of room for improvement. You will make an effort so that she will like you, and then you will confess your love again. It's not too late to give up after that. Mikan, it was true that I told her my feelings without any effort of improving myself. If I make an effort so that she would like me, the results might... But I don't know what I should do to improve myself. <laughs> That's why I'm here, Oni-chan. I'm one of the popular kids at school, unlike you. I can teach you the ways of becoming the man that even Kamiya would fall in love with. My sister's words sometimes really hurt my feelings. According to rumors, my sister was as popular as Kamiya at school. Master! That's it! Now stroke my head! Right away! So my sister was going to teach me how to improve myself. 
So what should I do? I'll teach you later. You can just carry on with stroking my head for now. Yes, master! Hmm, you are very good at this. The day after I confessed? Um, Mikan, what exactly are you- Don't move, Oni-chan. It's looking good. <laughs> What's the matter? Your nose is bleeding. I was right about you. You are the best, Oni-chan. I didn't really know what she was saying, but I wanted her to wipe her nose. We haven't gone to school together for a while. Yeah, it's been a while. Isn't everyone looking this way? I felt the eyes of people every time I walked past someone. I usually don't get this much attention because I'm an introvert. I see. It's because I'm with you today. Well, that might be part of the reason, but I think you are the center of attention right now. Do I look that weird? I changed from glasses to contact lenses and had my hairstyle changed a bit. So I think it is different compared to usual. You didn't show me the mirror. There's no need to. She wouldn't show me what I look like. Don't worry. You'll always be the brother that I love. I have nothing apart from my sister's love that assures my appearance. I said bye to Mikan and headed to my classroom, feeling nervous. <gasps> Everyone looked at me as I entered the room and froze. What the hell do I look like? Everyone's reaction made me even more worried. I need to go and talk to Kamiya. I put my bag on my desk in the classroom and then left, ignoring my classmates' eyes. Mikan told me that I should first of all go and talk to Kamiya. For an introvert, talking to someone whom you've never talked to is an extremely challenging thing to do. I hope I won't break down. I should first apologize about yesterday. Maybe my impression will change if I beg for forgiveness on the floor. She probably thinks that I'm a weird person because I told her I like her the first time we talked. As I was walking towards her classroom, she came out of the door at a perfect timing. Oh! Kamiya! Um... I wanted to say thank you about yesterday. Oh! You're the boy who dropped the pile of paper? I was so happy that she remembered me. I'm Riku Sahara. Oh, um... Nice to meet you. Things weren't going smoothly at all. Maybe I should beg for forgiveness after all. I was surprised. You've changed quite a lot since yesterday. Really? I didn't have a clue what I looked like apart from the fact that I wasn't wearing glasses anymore. I should have gone to the toilet to check before talking to her. Yeah, I'm really surprised. You look cooler than you did yesterday. Master Mikan! You were right! <laughs> what did I tell you? You made the correct decision leaving it to me. You will be my master forever! You can stay by my side forever and I'll feed you. That's a completely different story, sister. I decided to leave everything to Mikan, now that Kamiya had a good impression of me. I'm so lucky to have an excellent sister who can teach me the ways of being attractive. Master, why do I have to read shoujo manga? Shoujo manga consists of the inner desires that girls have. So if you study this and use the techniques, Kamiya will fall in love with you. Hmm, I'm a little skeptical. Hurry up and finish it. Then you must learn the skill Kabadan. You're telling me to do Kabedon on Kamiya? I'm very worried that she will think I'm a weirdo if I suddenly do Kabedon on her. If this helps get girls, the walls all around Japan would be full of holes. Are you questioning my methods? You should just do as I say and I will assure you it will go well! Yes, master! <laughs> What's the matter, Mikan? Nothing, Oni-chan. And the following day, I... Hey, don't look away from me. I was doing Kabedon to Kamiya. I did it again. I called her out to the rooftop and did what the characters were doing in the shoujo manga. <gasps> and then Kamiya blushed. What is it, all of a sudden? Of course. Naturally, anyone would be surprised if this happened to them out of nowhere. But her reaction? It's very similar to the reaction of the female character. Did I just succeed? Then I should ask her on a date. Just like Mikan told me what happened in the shoujo manga. Normally, I don't think anyone would go out on a date with me just because I did Kabedon on them. Hey, I was wondering if you could make time for me this Saturday. I want to go on a date with you. Uh, okay. Why? Master Mikan, you are almighty! I bowed deeply with gratitude to my sister because I was able to ask Kamiya out on a date with a plan that I would have been too skeptical to bring into action without her support. Are you kidding me? Huh? What was that? Nothing, Oni-chan. Now you should understand that my advice works. 
If you do as I say, you will be able to get Kamiya's heart. Wow, Master. I thought you were tricking me at first. It turns out that you are a real master. Then next, you must kiss her. Master? No, 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 no. That's way too soon. You're naive, Oni-chan. Way too naive. When you are in love, you need to take the big steps and fly into the sky like Icarus. Well, if my memory is correct, Icarus falls and hits the ground in the end. No, 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 Oni-chan. The fact that she accepted your offer is proof that she is starting to like you. Huh? Is that true? As you learn from Kabadon, girls like it when boys approach them and be a bit rough. She will fall in love with you if you go for the kiss. I want to know whether that is morally acceptable, sister. This should do it. Mikan whispered something. I got shivers down my spine. I mean, the advice she had given me so far has had good results, so I guess it's worth trying. If she doesn't want to kiss me, then I'll apologize and beg for forgiveness on the floor before I get to her lips. Maybe I'll just give it a try. Ah, Sarah! The day before the date with Sahara! I was screaming by myself in my room because Sahara is just too attractive recently! He wasn't anything like what he told me when he liked me the other day, but he looks so different. When he puts his glasses on, he's just the type I really like. As a shoujo manga lover, that Kabadon was just too good to be true. I know I am a simple girl, and I did turn him down once, but I think about him every day. What should I wear? I wonder if he likes cute clothes. The day of the date had come. I hope my clothes were okay. I just bought what a mannequin was wearing. I did get it at a fashionable store, and Mikan also told me it looked good while having a nosebleed, so... I think it will be okay. Well, at least I hope so. S sorry for keeping you waiting. I waited for a few minutes, and then Kamiya showed up. She was wearing cute clothes, and she had a bit of makeup on her already beautiful face, which made her even more beautiful than usual. Shall we get going? I couldn't take my eyes off her. Uh, are you alright, Sarah? <laughs> sorry about that. It's just that you're a little too cute, so... Huh? I wonder if this phenomenon of nosebleeds is in our DNA. So, where shall we go then? Uh, I'll leave it up to you. Her tone of voice was high and a little awkward. Maybe she's nervous. She is friends with everyone, so I don't think she would get nervous going on a date with a guy. Who was it that was being self-conscious and thinking that she's nervous because she's on a date with me, and not some other guy? Oh wait, that was me! It's my first time here, too, so let's go on things that we're interested in. I walked a little ahead of Kamiya with the same pace as her, and then she reached out and held my hand. It was so sudden that I couldn't help but blush. But it's all right. I'm not the same me that I used to be. Don't misunderstand this. This is probably because it would be problematic if we lose sight of each other. It's not because she wants to hold hands. I wanted to hold your hand. Kamiya? What would make her want to hold hands with me? Maybe she's starting to like me just like Mikan told me. But I have to respond in a cool manner all the time. The characters in the shoujo manga were all very cool and calm all the time. Right, Riku? I... 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 I I'm okay with it. That was so embarrassing. I started like crazy. After that, we did lots of things. A roller coaster. How frightening was that? I can't believe that there are human beings who think that this is entertaining. Oh, that was so much fun! It was really fun. Hmm, it's really well made. Ah! How are you not scared of this? Don't worry, I'm good with this stuff. If anything happens to you, I'll protect you. P protect Here you go. Thanks! I'll pay for it. I accidentally bought too, so don't worry about it. You're too kind. And when the sun was about to go down, we were on a Ferris wheel. Oh no, I don't have time left! I enjoyed the time I spent with her and fell in love even harder, so I was too occupied with her! Losing track of time is okay, but I don't know when I should kiss her! This is my final chance. I feel like it is the best opportunity as well, but I still don't know if kissing her out of the blue is an appropriate thing to do. The gentleman inside me was telling me about how morally inappropriate this was, turning me into a coward. What's the matter, Sahara? 
Oh, what the heck? If I back out now, I'll go back to the coward that I used to be. Trust me, Khan. With all your heart. I pushed myself in the back and... Kamiya? Huh? Tell me if you don't want to. I'll quit if she rejects me. According to Mikan, you can't refuse if you like someone. I can even hear my heart thumping. Um, wait, Sarah. And there goes my love. She said wait, so she didn't want to. So this is proof that she doesn't like me. Sorry, Mikan. I couldn't make it even with your support. Well, um, if you want to go further, I want you to be my boyfriend. What? So, um... I'm happy, and I'm fine with it. It's just that I want to do those kinds of things after we start dating. Oh, okay. Sarah, do you love me? I know I turned you down once, but... I love you, Kamiya. Really? I'm so happy. So it's all thanks to you, Master, that I was able to start dating Kamiya. Oh, you are extraordinary, Mikan. At first I was like, there's no way I will be able to date her doing this. But your advice actually worked. She is an extraordinary sister. If I was on my own, I would have given up from the very beginning. I will thank her for the rest of my life. This wasn't supposed to happen. But Mikan didn't look happy. And her fist was shaking. And... But you were supposed to be mine, Oni-chan. Um... I was teaching you things that were unbelievable so that Kamiya would hate you. I was trying to destroy your love. Why did it all go so well? How terrifying what my sister was thinking. No wonder I thought that there was no way it would work. But it is thanks to Mikan that I was able to date Kamiya. And I love my sister, even if she has a dark side to her. Don't worry. I will date Kamiya, but I am yours. Really? Yeah, I promise. Will you stay with me forever? That, again, is a completely different story.